what's up y'all i haven't been here in a long time it's a lot of catching up to do i'm gonna catch y'all up in about oh let me come let me come in now it's a lot of catching up to do um i am on the go right now um i am on my way to look at an apartment because your girl is continuing the apartment hunt um it's a lot of things i gotta catch up oh wait it's a lot of things that i gotta uh let y'all catch up on but i am currently following the gps as we speak but and i am driving um i I'm, i was at work and i got off work early um just to look at this apartment um, my appointment is at 11 and it's 11 03. i think i'm about to pull up in about two minutes so i'll let y'all see the apartment when i get there oh baby you see the pool I think they got two pools, y'all. But y'all know me. I love a good pool. These are the apartments. It looks super nice. Um, I'm waiting for the lady to come back so she can give me the tour of the of the um what you call them. But it's super nice. It looks it looks nice and I can't wait to go see. But they haven't stopped them. So that's where we at. So this is like the dining area, y'all. This is the Living room. Right. And then this is like a little you can have this like an office space. I plan to put my YouTube stuff right there if I was to get it. Um, and then down here, this is my small, small, small kitchen. It's very, very small. She got the dishes alone, the stove, the refrigerator. And this is the room. Pretty small. They have this little area for you to brush your teeth. And this is the bathroom area with the shower and stuff. So, yeah. And then it comes with the washing dry. So, I'm not sure if y'all can see me in the apartment, but yes, this is the apartment. This is the apartment. And I'm liking the, the sun area. So, yes. Had to get my little thumbnail, y'all. And then it also comes. Okay. And washing and drying. Yes. I must I like these because I'm on my next apartment. It's hopefully I can tour one. This wasn't scheduled. Um, I just come and pick up an application, but I'm not sure if we can tour one. But these are pretty big. It's an east and a west apartment. And I'm at the East Wings because these are the ones I have available. So I'm about to go in and see what they say. So guys, I got the tour of the top. It's a nice and private. It's a pretty deep private. This is nice. Yeah, I like this. Yeah, this is nice. I like this. Yeah, I wasn't sure if I did. Yeah, that one. I think I, I like this. I like this. Um, mm -hmm. Do y'all fully equip? Y'all, you have the option to fully equip or? To furnish it? Yeah. Yeah, we do. We do. Um, uh -huh. Um, there is a fee we use court. Mm -hmm. I think most people can get certain pieces if you want certain things. Mm -hmm. That's also an option too. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. So there is a rental fee and. Pretty good. So you guys, um, I just wanted to catch up with y'all briefly before um before I get started with the rest of my day. So basically today is today is yeah I got some of the notifications don't mind it but today is January 14th and um and today makes the first day to make it today makes the first day that I am out of quarantine so I know you guys I've been gone and lost um, but yes, I did have COVID, um, 
my paperwork is actually over there in the other seat. Um, basically, um, I work at two hospitals. And they've been having outbreaks after outbreaks after outbreaks. And mind you, they're supposed to inform the employees, but they try to be secretive about it. So, hold on, so y'all can hear me. Yeah, so, um, yeah. Yeah, so they try to be, <clears throat> they try to be secretive about it and not inform the employees, which, which, um, I kind of felt like they should have, um, because it's out of the safety of the employees. But, um, so yeah, it was just like outbreak after outbreak. And then, um, one of the employees, a, a lot of the employees ended up getting COVID, um, and they tried to be secretive about it again. And so happened to be one of the guys that got it. Um, he will always be in my office. He was a social worker, um, and he will always ask to see my or um, he always wanted to the airplanes, y'all. Basically, he will always want to come to my office um, to like spare time or whatever when um, right before he clocks out, and he will always use my office. And so happened to be that they he ended up getting COVID and he ended up texting one of the other social workers and then they, she let us know. But he wanted to he wanted it to be a secret tip. He don't he wanted it to be a secret. I don't know why, but he wanted it to be a secret so bad. But she ended up telling us. And then that same day she told us was the same day I started feeling the symptoms, which was last Friday. It was Friday evening, probably like right around the time I got off, um, maybe about five, six, or seven. I started feeling like uh, like weak, um, not weak, but I started feeling like my body ache, like my it would be my it was my wrist at first, then my arms, and then it kind of went to my shoulders and my back, and then I kind of like had a, like a slight cough, but you know you can feel like like your body feels. Ch like chilly like you know you've always feeling cold I mean I know I'm always cold but I was started having this feeling so I went <clears throat> I took a shower no I took a bath I put some um Dr. Till some um Epsom salt in there and I kind of soaked but that still didn't help and so like that night yo oh my gosh that night um the camera just don't want to do right at all. But that night, I don't know what they be talking about. But that night, um, I started having this cough, and my nose, like it's like congestion, like I couldn't breathe, and I always keep vapor up on me at all times, and we're always in my purse. Put out that vapor up, and that whole night I was coughing, like slight coughing, like I felt like my I couldn't breathe. So I was like, that Saturday morning I woke up, I was feeling horrible. It was, I wasn't feeling horrible, but it's like, you know when you sick and you know your body just felt so tired. <clears throat> so I was like, oh hell, and I got to get tested. But mind you, I had a lot going on. I had a lot that I was supposed to do that Saturday. So it was my brother's graduation. And then I was supposed to pick up my guy child. And then we were supposed to go to this baby shower, my friend baby shower. But I was like, fuck it. I text my best friend. I'm like, look, I, I'm going to have to come get her next week or another weekend. I'm just not feeling it. Then I was like, my brother had like a little walk-in graduation. So it was like only like five, literally five minutes. We came. They, um, his One of his teachers spoke about him. They said his name, gave him his diploma, took the picture. We took pictures and we left. So um, I had my mask on the whole time, but I knew I was feeling so bad. So I was like, I got to get tested. I went to three urgent care. I went to three because I'm like, okay, I know which two only accepts my Medicaid. But I'm going to try to go to another one to try to see if I can just pay because I need one bad. I I want to know bad, so bad. So I ended up, it was a long day, and I ended up getting tested like around 2, maybe 2 o'clock. No, maybe like one one thirty, two o'clock. And it came back positive, so I went and got some Chick-fil-A. Luckily, I still had my taste and my smell. I went because I was so hungry. I was like, I didn't want to eat nothing until I found out. I, I, I didn't want to do anything until I found out. I went and got Chick-fil-A. 
and then I ate Chick-fil-A, and then um, I took a nap, but then my car was so cold. Well, I felt like so, my body felt so cold, but I really wasn't. I had my heat on that whole day, and I took a nap in my car, parked behind this little hotel by this Chick-fil-A, and um, I put my seat back, I put my windows up, I locked my doors, and I took me a nice, I think I like a, maybe like an hour, hour and ten minutes, it was like a nap. And then I woke up, it was like 4 o'clock, I went to my cousin, and I told my cousin, and basically he had to quarantine, so I quarantined, and today is my first, well, yesterday, I went back to work yesterday, uh, but today, um, today is actually my official day that I don't have COVID, well, I don't know if I still, it's probably still in my system, but I don't have, well, I stopped feeling the symptoms Monday evening, so like that whole Saturday night like y'all i went and got y'all this is my bag show y'all my bag i went and got this my whole bag and i got so much stuff in here like i had got i had this i had went and got this i went and got claritin I had so much thing. I went and got these little chicken. I haven't even. I didn't even um, need this, but I went and got these. Uh, this chicken noodle soup. I got four things of those. I got some holes because my throat was itching too. That was another symptom too. My throat was itching, but some holes and and some Tylenol. What is Tylenol? Though? I had got a big thing of it. But I got a big thing of it. And it's for muscle pains, muscle aches and pain. This and that and this um this thing right here did some justice. And them holes. What? And I had bought some um some other like some chicken noodle. Some chicken noodle, regular chicken noodles, ramen noodles. And I had um I had that the first two days, two or three days. Like I had it that night. And usually I don't drink the juice, but I had to make my noodles the way I make them. And then I put a little hot sauce in it. Where's my camera? Basically, I um I ended up um I drank the juice and I started feeling better. Like that 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 mon no that Monday evening, like I had broke the sweats and everything. Like that night, the first two nights I sweated the most. Like. I was sweating in my sleep, like you could, like all on my leg, all the back of my legs, like under my arms, my back, my my face. It was just like sweating, and I hardly ever sweat, but I had to break that sweat. I think that's what it helped. But basically, I that happened, and um, I have been looking, applying for apartments. I mean, I have been applying for jobs. And my job that I have, my I have two jobs. So my favorite, my other job, um, they offered me the full time position, and I have been saving up for this. So I have a savings account, and my savings account is basically what whoever I wherever I decided to move at. But whoever gave me whoever gave me that full time position, I was gonna just jump on it and start applying for apartments. So I have been looking, and that's why I've been doing these apartment tours or whatever. Um, I actually like these apartments better. It, the only the only thing about it is they have these little ducks, but I'm not really worried about that as long as I don't see it. And that it's by the airport, like as you can see that you constantly hear the planes, but I don't think that that will bother me. Um, I feel like it's peace. I feel like it's peace and quiet. It's very big. I'm gonna let y'all see it when I'm driving, how big it is. Like it's two, um, it's two sides. They have an east and a west. And, and the scenery is nice. It's right by the levee, by the lake in the back. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. But, um, yeah, so long keep. So I just had to let y'all know that. And, yeah, so I'm going to go get me something to eat. And I'm going to close Oh, yeah, because I got my fidget tipping. But see what it say? Yuga S Club Sports. Well, my hand all in the way. But this is a little thing that they gave me. My little receipt or whatever. So, I got, I should have got it expedited, which I wanted to, but that shit is pricey as hell. Um, it was like an extra $65, even though I know I have it, but like, it's okay, like, it's okay if, you know, it's the regular six to eight weeks. 
um well it says six to eight weeks so hopefully it comes i know it's gonna come before the trip so um i put on there i filled out everything um if it, it said it's gonna take up to six to eight weeks so i know it's gonna come before the trip and i'm excited about the trip if y'all didn't know i'm going on a special trip i ain't even gonna tell y'all because i'm gonna vlog it but it's gonna be in the middle of april it's for my cousin's birthday even if i give even if i don't go if my passport don't come in time because it's some saving up that i have to do for this trip but even if i don't go on the trip i still got my passport because my friend stays in london no my friend stays in england overseas with her husband and your girl might have to do a little pop up on her and spend a couple of days out there see what london i mean england is about so yeah so i just wanted to um I know I haven't talked to y'all in a while. Um, I wanted to close out the video of everything that I have all together. So, this is going to be a whole vlog in one from about three weeks ago to now. It's going to be a whole bunch of stuff combined. So, I just wanted to close that out with, um, well, I just wanted to, uh, no, you know what? I might make a separate intro, outro. Um, yeah. So I might I might make this two separate videos. But um but yeah. So I ain't gonna close this one. Oh, should I? No, I ain't gonna close this out this one out yet because I'm gonna pick up my baby tomorrow. And then um Sunday I'm gonna have both of them. Both of my god kids. And we probably gonna do something and I'm gonna let them close out the video. But yeah, so stay tuned for that. All right. <laughs> Right. Hey guys, we're playing with the Coney. Mm -hmm. Talk to Lana. And uh, we're playing with the Coney to get cat. And, and we do the pony hair. And we got the notebook in the tail. And, the, and, and we're playing the Octodoo. And we're playing the house. Talk to the, the video. Tell, talk to the video. You can talk Stop. to the video. <laughs> we're playing the unicorn. Mm -hmm. And then we were in the. Mm -hmm. And we're not doing nothing because we're going to put the corner and build it and make it house and everything. Yep. Say, I, I, I am beautiful. I am beautiful. beautiful. Say, I am beautiful. I am beautiful. Say, I am strong. I am strong. Say, I am strong. I am strong. I am strong. Okay. I am Say, I am strong. Say, I am I am confident. I am confident. Say, I am confident. 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 I Let's see, say, I love my family. I love my family. Hmm, let's see, two more. What y'all like about yourself? Lana, you go first. Lana, you go first. What you like about yourself? I like to play with my unicorn all day. You play with your, so, say, I like to play with my unicorn. I like to play with my unicorn. Okay, Anaya, what you like about yourself? Play with Lana. You like to play with Lana? Say, I like to play with Lana. I, I will play with Lana. Say, I? Like to, like to play with Lana. Good. Okay. Say I, and then the last one. Put that down. The last one. Say I love myself. 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 I love myself.